if emergency relief wasn't here, I don't know what we'd do. I kind of always thought that I wouldn't be eligible because my husband works and we're not on a healthcare card or, or anything. When I came here, I was very nervous. I wasn't sure if they could help at all. But I looked at the figures and there was just no way we were going to survive unless I, I got help somehow. There's no money for things like haircuts. Um, we never go out to the movies. We never go out and sit in a cafe. Never go on dates anymore. So it's really hard because it, when we moved, I'm not able to see my friends or anything because the fuel costs too much to go see them. Or even the Mikey expenses, they cost too much to go see them. You know, I pretty much just I suppose to try to survive in a way. And as it is there, I've got my scripts here and they've, they've been amazing. They gave me a, um, a food voucher and they're, they're helping me with the scripts. I think you always kind of have a dream in the back of your mind as to what you'd like your life to look like. Some of it's not always realistic, but I think my I think my biggest dream is just to be able to have somewhere secure and stable and um, could happen to anyone. You could get sick, you could lose your job, you might not have that support network. Where would you turn if something happened and you didn't have that income or that support?